welcome back to my youtube channel i have missed you so much i haven't filmed for so long because i filmed so much footage prior to like the day i just gave myself like a week to 10 days off um but as you can see by the title of today's video you can probably guess where we are so excited El. we're in the car on the like in the queue to mcdonald's this is our first mcdonald's since uh, before lockdown because we just haven't felt the need to go and um but we today we don't really feel the need to go really well no like not until we actually got on the way here like on the way here i just got incredibly excited and like i actually want to go so we're gonna like get some yummy things i want to try some things i haven't normally had because make it a bit interesting i'm basically going to do a little chatty q a answering things you guys want to talk to us about questions and yeah so without further ado let's get into the video I literally wanted to make We've got fish. Yeah. I've got a fillet of fish. I've never told you guys before, but so got. Let's go for the order then, Greg. So we've got two Coke Zeros because that's like the only drink you can have. Wait, 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 not McDonald's. Oh, have they it's gone? Have they done no ice oils? Yeah, they have. Have, have they? Mine. Usually, I'd go for a milkshake. Mm -mm -mm. And I quite like an Oasis. Do you? Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. I need to get comfy because I'm not very comfy. Okay, so we've got... I've got a McChicken sandwich. Oh, that is hanging oh. out. Greg's got a quarter pound of cheese. Then we, we are probably greedy today because I have got a chicken... No, a cheese share box, which... Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And then we've also got 20 chicken nugget share box because oh my god look how many sauces we've got oh my god look when i say we've got like five billion sauces we've got five billion sauces then what else have we got what oh i've god. got a fillet of fish so i've never had one before and i've always really wanted to try one i was like do you know what cheat day being cheat day and all i was like right I'm gonna have a bit of fish, so much to have at first, I think. Can we get the chips out as well now? Oh, just yeah. so they're not on me. Okay, this is a bit weird. Oh. It's got cheese on it. Oh, can I have a bite of your fillet of fish? Of course you can. Okay, guys, this is what it looks like. It's just, it's got a bit of cheese there. And it's just a piece. Oh, it's got tartar sauce on. There you go. Can you see that? Okay, ready? First. Ready? Wow. I am out of that. Mmm. I could eat that. I really like that. What's she order? Fish for me. I think what is a pescatarian with that? <laughs> Likes one fillet of fish can go pescatarian. No, guys, because my diet is literally pescatarian. You have ham every day. Okay, I could quite easily cut that out though, couldn't I? Yeah. Well, yeah, but you're not... It is, but it's not. Like, it just so happens that that's what we buy from shopping. But you still have other meals in the week. Mm. Like a roast dinner. Yeah. Mm. Right, guys. So, first of all, Greg's new hair. Don't put it in the shop. Whoa. Whoa. Look at him. New He's hair, blonde. <laughs> it's just a bit of a change, isn't it, really? Mm. But it's a good change. You don't like it? No. I mean... I don't think I'll keep it forever, but... Mm, 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 mm. We're going to be answering some questions. Yeah, yeah. So, if you're not following my Instagram, then go and follow it, because you should be. Um, I'll put it on the screen now for you. So, but on my Instagram, one was like, um, can you give me lots of questions, guys? So, you guys did not hold back and gave me so many questions, like so many so a lot of them are actually the same thing which is quite interesting actually mm. um but i thought we'll just we'll just go through the order so the first one is what's happening about bali so if you guys didn't know we booked to go to bali for my 23rd birthday 
probs not happening, not gonna lie. Um, obviously we're gonna keep our hopes up, but eh, it's probably not gonna. It's probably not gonna happen, is it, Greg? No. It is what it is, though. Yeah. Right. Okay, next one is, now Greg has dyed his hair blonde, will you go brunette? I basically am, look. I basically am already, so. Just doing a little switch, haven't we? Yeah, basically. Oh my god, I'm so excited to eat this. Oh I can't believe I only got a bite of that fish burger. It was actually really nice. I really enjoyed it. It was really nice. Oh, evidently, Al. Right. Um, who are your favourite YouTubers? Oh, easy. Who is it? Ali and Con. Ali and Con. They're anyone that you like on their own? Um, I don't know. I like Joe Delaney. And Joe Weller. Joe Weller. I love Joe Weller. Like, so they were my favourites before I was with you. Mm -hmm. What is one thing you don't like about each other? Um, don't say loud eat him. Okay, you that's what I was going to say. You've said that before. Well, that's the only thing I don't really like about you. No, come on. You might as well insult me. Come on. Um, that we'll clean the flat and then you just make it a mess again so quickly. No. You do? Sorry, who cleaned the flat yesterday? You cleaned it, but usually it's like a joint effort. Mm. And then you make it a mess very quickly. True. Um, oh, there's too many to count. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, I don't know. My lack of communication. Yeah, Greg doesn't communicate. Like, it really, really annoys me. Um, like, he'll, like, like, something would annoy him, but he'd, like, be like, oh, it doesn't annoy me that much, I'm not going to say anything. It's like, I would just say it because that's who I am. Like, something annoys me, I just come out with it straight away. Mm. No matter who you are, I just come out with it. And you know that. Like, yeah. something, like, even if it's not worth mentioning, I'll still mention it because it's just who I am. But, um, you won't do that, will you? Like, you won't. No, because sometimes things don't need to be said. Yeah, exactly, but that's just not me, and I just get annoyed. Also, guys, just going to have a bit of my chicken mayo now. <laughs> Second burger. Mm. Should we swap? Ready? Oh, oh no. Mmm. Do you like a chicken mayo or not? I do like them, but I just wouldn't pick them. What is the key to a good relationship? Communication. Do you though? I wouldn't say it was because, like, like, our, like it, was, it is though, because our communication is really good. Yeah, but... About... Is normal things mm -hmm. but we just never annoy each other really like we no. never like we never do anything to like annoy the other one or like do you know what i mean like we just get on very well like when you meet the person you'll just know like i knew with greg like i never I think you, just, you just know when you're with the right person like if you don't see yourself marrying them you're with, you're with the wrong person like generally like you are aren't you that's one if you could do YouTube YouTube full time, would you? Of course I would. Like YouTube is like the dream. Like I'm very lucky actually because I've been given like an insight to what it would be like being like furloughed and stuff and not working. It's what it would be like being a YouTuber, and I can't moan like it's not a bad life. No, not at all. Like I made a bit of a mess here well, with my seeds. Have you? Like, like it's not. It's like the dream job, isn't it? It's like that lighting is really annoying me. It's just there we go. Oh no. no. Um Yeah, of course I would like defo. 100 percent Next one. Oh 100 percent 100 percent Um How to get over heartbreak. I can't say I've ever had my heart broken. I think it's one for you, Greg. Um <laughs> Try not to mope around too much for too long. Um surround yourself with people that care about you um, and just try and keep yourself busy like just try not like I don't know and then slowly like it does get easier and then within three four months you're like a completely different person yeah another thing would just be like put yourself out there and go out and meet people and like enjoy being single and then while you're doing that something good will happen you just swooped in there, didn't you? Yeah. Grab like, me. Obviously, if you've just been broken up with, you probably don't want to go into another relationship straight away because you would still care about that person. Where am I? The one. 
more questions. Another one. one. What were your first impressions of each other when you first, when you bet, when you both met for the first time? I thought you were very loud and confident. Not in like a bad you way. You were just very loud. Yeah. Confident. Do you remember meeting me for the first time? Um, I don't remember meeting you, but I just no. remember. I just remember seeing. Like I just remember around when we met. Before we had a good bomb as well, though. Did you? Yeah. Naughty. So wait, wait. So what were the first things you noticed about me then? My ass. <laughs> Your voice. My voice. <laughs> and then my ass. I heard you before I saw you. What did you think? Oh, what was this? I can't say that much time. Can I? Oh, come on, what was yours? You're very good at these questions. Sorry. You're just getting too distracted. Um, it's food. Um, I thought you were like, all right looking. I was like, yeah. Like, here you go, because you, you, you're my type, weren't you? Well, you were, like, dark hair. <laughs> Why not now? Well, you still are, because I love you, but, like, I wouldn't actually, like, go towards you now, I don't think. Because I don't like your hair. You would. <laughs> I wouldn't. Um, you know, I, you I just like, You'd I remember like, like oh. well the, I can't really remember the first time we met because when we first met like, I didn't really speak to you. No, not properly. I'd say like when I like, when I rejoined the gym, that's when I class. Mm, I did used to give you biscuits. Yeah. But you were, you were very quiet, like very quiet. You never really spoke to me, so I can't really tell you what you mm. were like. But when I can remember, um, I just remember being like, oh, he's so lovely. Like, you are so nice. Like, I want, I, like, I just want that type of relationship. And I went and got it. <laughs> um, what is your favourite thing about each other? That's quite nice. No one ever says that's positives. Okay, well, my favourite thing about you is that you care about everyone else before yourself. Like, you will think, even if you don't even know the person, you'll always think about them before yourself. Like, you'll always think about someone else. How something you do is going to affect the other person before yourself you're very selfless selfless very right? uh, nice thing to say out yeah like you, you're just really like lovely like even if someone's been vile to you and treated you like utter shit you give people like longer than any normal person would i think <laughs> which mm. i do really like but like about you like that's for you yeah i'll never change it but yeah, no. that's nice mm. what's your favorite thing about, what's your favorite thing about me well, there's lots of ooh, lots of things though. I like I like the fact that you you give as much as like you get. Like you don't like you're not a selfish person. Mm. Like you you do. I don't really know how to say it, but you're a very giving person, and like you treat me how I treat you. Mm. Like we both like we both just give each other like. And you're a very everything. very positive. <gasps> a battery. Sorry guys, my fr my um, camera died, so we had to, and we, we've moved out of the sun because my camera was getting very hot in the sun. Okay, next question: Is there any U UK YouTubers you dislike? I don't really know any. I... Oh, the one I showed you yesterday. Oh. She he doesn't like Kira Bridget. Horrendous. <laughs> oh. Yeah, no, I like yeah, she's definitely one of the ones I. Like, really... if you spend your YouTube career shouting or making fun of yourself. In like, I don't know, yeah. Or pretend it's really serious and like unplanned when it's being completely planned. Like, mm. it's just looks stupid. Not my vibe. Not my vibe. Okay, next one. What's your biggest fear? I don't know. Uh, flying things. My biggest fear is generally like like flying insects. They freak me <laughs> out. Pigeons. And pigeon. Everything just freaks me out. Like I don't like. I don't enjoy things like that. Do I? Mm -mm. No. I, really I don't really don't. know. What, oh. Um, underground caves. Oh yeah, Greg's actually with, quite claustrophobic, aren't you? A little bit, yeah. With some things. Like you know when you go underground in caves and there's those like watery tunnel crevices you've got to crawl through. You've done it. I can't stand the thought of that. I could never do it. Could you not? I, I mean, I probably could if someone's like, oh, here's a tenner, go crawl through that. I'd be like, oh, yeah, sound. But. I wouldn't do it for the fun of it. Okay. Um, where, do you wanna, where do you hope to be in five years' time? I think they already covered this, but I'll mm. cover it again. It's a very long question. I don't know. It's not to a cover. 
No, I see myself married with kids in our own house. Successful. That's what I see myself. How do you see yourself? Well, I see myself with you, so I guess it'll be the same. Yeah. <laughs> do you have any regrets? If so, what are they? What's one mm. of the regrets? Wouldn't say I regret anything because that's what made me who I am now. Mm. We both say this because um, I was talking to my friends the other day actually, and um, we were saying like they were like saying like, oh, do you regret any of your past relationships? And I was like, definitely not because like I truly believe I would not respect how nice and lovely Greg is if I hadn't been treated like shit and like being controlled in my past, like. You just, you wouldn't realise it, would you? Like, you wouldn't understand what treated right is if you weren't treated bad before. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Um, what is one thing most people don't know about you? Oh. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Um, my middle name is Lloyd. <laughs> Oh, even I didn't know that until like six months into our... You did, okay, until, I had told No, you. until we went to Amsterdam, I did not know that. What's one thing about my mate? Um, that I was born premature. That's probably... Well, I think everyone knows that. Oh, shut <laughs> up, Greg. I was born prematurely, everyone. So I was an itty-bitty baby. Almost didn't survive, but I did. Um, if you had three wishes... Oh, my God. If you had three wishes, what would you wish for? That's good. I, I, I like this one. Right, you're not allowed to wish for more wishes. Okay, right. Because that's what I would okay. do. Okay, if I right. could wish for anything, okay, I'd wish good health on all my friends and family. That's the first thing I wish for. And myself. Like, obviously, that's my family, isn't it? That's technically the same. Um, stability in my life to be able to, like, give my children mm. stuff. And, like, a good life. And number three... I think I'd wish for like a superpower. Oh, that's cool. Like I think I'd wish right, like I was like invisible. All these wishes though, they always have like repercussions though. I know. If they didn't have any. If they didn't have any, yeah. yeah. I think I'd wish that I was like invisible. invisible. I, could turn, I could turn invisible or read minds. But then I don't know if I want to read minds. Because I'm obviously I, I, thinking I, about another girl. I and wish I could, I could accidentally fly. read you. And I'd be like, I wouldn't must tell you because I imagine if I couldn't tell anyone. Mm. Like you'd hate it, like you wouldn't, you wouldn't want to be with me, would you? Like, would you? That's a good question, actually. Would you want to be with me if I could read your mind all the time? No, because you get annoyed at me so much more. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good question. Would you, like, if you could read my my mind, would you get annoyed at me? I don't know. It depends what you're thinking. Honestly, it's not much. Normally, this shit normally. <laughs> Okay, next question. Oh, yeah, you do your um, approaches. I think mine would be very similar, to be honest, but I just want to be able to fly, probably. Fly? Yeah. Pretty, pretty cool, cool, wouldn't it? Oh, well, no, I'd probably do something. No, like actually, Iron no. Man. I would um, probably wish for, like, an unlimited supply of money. Yeah, that's not bad, is it? Okay, um... <laughs> if you had to live in another time period, which one would you, which one would you choose? What? I don't know. Like, maybe, like, what's the, like... Down to Abbey time. I don't know when it's set because I haven't really watched it, but it's not set like. I think it's set around World War Two. Yeah, like I'd want to live. What in, like, you want to live II. in World War Two? Well, no, like just after like after the war finished. Like, <laughs> big poopy dress. <laughs> no, but I would. I love that era. Yeah. Like, like I don't. Uh, I don't uh, particularly like any of the eras my mum and dad lived through. Like their their fashion sense was awful. I think I would go. Um, I think I'd quite like to be like a Spartan. What, what the hell's that? Greek. Oh, okay. Spartan warrior or a Viking. Okay. That'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? Raid England. Um, what foreign language would you want to master and why? Oh, wait, let me think. Let me think. Spanish. Why? It just sounds so like it just sounds all like sexy and like because Greg can speak a bit of Spanish, everyone. <laughs> Go on. Shut, shut I'm not speaking Spanish. No, you're not, you're no nervous. because it's probably not right, and I don't want it. People comment. Mm, yeah, you didn't, you didn't say anything right. <clears throat> you know, I want to learn Spanish because, like, ideally, like, I love going to Spain. I love going to Marbella. I love going to like the um, Balearic and um, what the Canary. Canary Islands. They're not like, my favorite place to holiday. <clears throat> so, and Mexico is big Spanish. So, like, 
There's a lot of places that I like to go that speak Spanish, so yeah, I'd like to speak Spanish. What would you want to speak? Mandarin. Mandarin? Mm. Yeah. Especially that, it's like a special language, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Ida's opinion, do you prefer Greg's hair blonde or how it was before? Definitely how it was before, I don't like it blonde. Didn't even need to. You knew it, I don't know. Yeah. I should like, can you please dye it back now? I don't like it. No, I will not be dying it back. Um, what's mm. something that annoys you? Oh, that's the same what? one. Would you leave Melbourne forever or stay in Melbourne forever? What, and it never depends. ever come back? If someone told me I'll pay for you to live in Florida for the rest of your life, not work, I'd move to Florida and never come to Melbourne again. Oh, I don't know. My mum would fly out to go and see me though. It would be fine. Mm. Or but I don't, I don't, I don't know if, if it's Malvern. Yeah, I know. We could go meet him in Worcester. That's yeah. Malvern. True. Um, what is the first thing you noticed about each other? Your bum. Was I like, by your bum. Was I Ellie, the one with a good bum? You were. Was I? You were. <laughs> Answer your half of the question. Just that you were like, quite good looking. I was like, oh. I don't know, because I thought you were good looking. I thought the first thing I noticed you were good looking, because obviously before you'd even like, open your mouth, I thought you were good looking. You thought I was young, though. Yeah, I literally, I didn't think he went. That's it, wasn't it? Oh, I don't remember now. I genuinely could not get over that he was like 23 at the time, and I was like 18. Yeah. Yeah. You would you just... Like 20... Three, yeah. just in 23, and I was 20, I was 18. Yeah, so I just turned 18, and Greg was 23, and I was like, what? You shouldn't really be looking at your bum, should I? No! <laughs> Like, I genuinely, like, could not believe you were that I remember now, I was, like, so in disbelief that you were old. I was like, what? If you could live anywhere, then where would it be? Live anywhere. Anywhere. Um, where would it be? Um, if, like, jobs weren't in the question, I'd quite like to move to, like, L.A. No, I don't think I could deal with that lifestyle Do you constantly. Not? No. Um, it's quite hard. I think somewhere like somewhere in Australia. Oh, Australia. It's just more like chilled out. No one's. You don't get as many like pretentious people there. You don't know. You might do. I don't know. LA is very like. Yeah, true. Like, as much as we are kind of quite showy people, we're not LA. Yeah, I get what you mean. <coughs> okay, dream job. Um. Well, my dream job. Like dream, dream job. Like even it's re unrealistic. Footballer. Fair enough. Oh, fair, fair enough, Greg. Mine would be. Well, you had your dream job. Yeah, you? I had my dream job. I got my dream job as a YouTuber. To be fair, like my dream job is being a YouTuber. Like I love how my time. dream job is a footballer. I don't even play football anymore. No. <laughs> okay, where would you like to go on holiday? Um, anywhere right now. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, like my, I really want to go to Bora Bora. Yeah, like obviously that's like one of like the dream destination. That is a dream, a dr absolute dream. Depends what the holiday's for as well. Dream car. Oh, <gasps> dream oh. car. What is it gonna be? Um, I don't know. There's so many. G wagon. Once I have that car, I've I have made it. Like I've always wanted one, always. And when I get it, because I am gonna get it, I am just. That, that, that my so life. That if I could have any car right now and it was all paid for for me, all the maintenance and everything, the fuel was paid for, I would have a Lamborghini Huracan. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> fair enough, fair enough. Right guys, I, there's, there's, there's still a few more questions but I think that's enough for today. So we're going to wrap, wrap up today's video. If you have enjoyed them, please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and comment down below how you found today's video and let us know what other videos you want us to do. And that is it from us, isn't it? it I hope is. you found out some other th you things you didn't know about us. And I will catch you in my next video.